What's up, Lock Me Baby? E e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e. I hope y'all doing good, cause I'm doing wonderful. Before we get started into this fun, 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 fun video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And again, thank you so much for turning my channel up, up and for watching me and for commenting. Thank you so much. So like I said, I have six outfits. So y'all know me, I'm very cheap, budget, whatever you wanna call it. I just like to make sure I'm not spending too much money and I wanna give you guys some ideas what you guys, you expecting mommies can do for Halloween. Um, I do have an outfit that I am gonna wear specifically for Halloween, but I'm gonna be just about going into labor almost. So um, I'm not gonna be participating too much. <laughs> So, but I do want to give you guys the ideas and go ahead and get this video out the way so you guys can, you know, start looking and searching. Okay, y'all, so this is my first maternity outfit. I would say this is the more simpler ones. If your boyfriend has a jersey or something, you can be an athlete. So I decided to be an Atlanta United uh, soccer player. I don't have cleats or anything. Well, my boyfriend has cleats, but... I'm not about to put my feet in his nasty shoes. <laughs> so I got some socks, some little um, striped socks here. And I have my, uh, what are these called? Vans on to go with it. Comfortable shoes, I mean, you're pregnant. So first of all, you want to be comfortable in your Halloween outfit. And then on top of that, I have some um, little boy short leggings on to go with it. But you can also, I mean, if you're outside, you're gonna probably want some leggings or some yoga pants you know just like I said very basic but still cute I wanted to do these because I just feel like it would give it a better look so you know just do your boyfriend's clothes so that's one way to save money and still be cute on Halloween all right and my next outfit is the cow outfit I'm gonna give y'all a closer look I got my little cow ears I got this from Amazon and not only does it come with the ears, it comes with the tail. <laughs> Our dog just looking at me like, really mom? Anyways, so yeah, it has a little cow tail and the cow ears to go with it. I decided to wear my maternity nursing bra t-shirt um, that I wear a lot of times. It's actually fading, to be honest. But yeah, you get to show that belly and then have some cute leggings on, just some regular black leggings that you probably have a million of, and then some boots. So I feel like this went well. So y'all can see what we do. So, yep. Ready for Halloween. Ready, 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 ready. Strutting in my boots. Move. <laughs> And also, I feel like the shorts that I wore before for the first outfit, you can also wear it um, with this outfit as well. So, or yoga pants. So just whatever is comfortable. Cause first of all, we pregnant. Not everything is comfortable with pregnancy and as we all know. So anyways, next outfit. All right, this is outfit number three, y'all. So comment below, what am I? What am I? Rub it. <laughs> so I can also be a froggy and be cute and be pregnant. So looky, looky. Let's see. So I got the, let's go, I got the ears or eyes technically. And then I got this little bow tie with this little cute white um, off the shoulder. Mind you, these clothes that I put on with it, I've already had. Um, besides one outfit, but other than that, like I said, I've already had or like stole it from my boyfriend. So, sorry for the crunching, my dog's eating who knows what. But, anyways, so yeah, so you can do this. Oh, and then it comes with the tail. You could be a froggy. Oh, wait, that's a bunny. Probably should get low, but see, 
see that might that might make me um go into labor so i'm not gonna get down there because usually they like down there so i ain't doing that anyways y'all so then i put it with my boots that i put with the other outfit or you can wear if you feel comfortable wear some boots that got more heels on it like if you want to be sexy you can like don't forget when you're pregnant you can still be sexy and cute all at the same time and comfortable so if you want to go with this route i got this also from amazon this this and the tail so really 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 cute and actually um this top if you guys are interested i got this top from um ross i believe yeah it was ross and this is actually a maternity top and usually you can tell because it has the little whatever but anyways but yeah i think it's really really cute so peace rabbit all right y'all this is outfit number four or five i'm not really sure so nothing too crazy um this shirt came from amazon as well it says let me out i do plan on wearing this on the 30 well yeah the 31st for sure the other outfits i don't think i'm gonna wear because i don't think i'm really gonna be doing anything like i said because i'm really gonna be like at that edge well i'll be let's see 38 weeks in so it's gonna be like chop 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 time but if i do go somewhere maybe i'll wear this with the other outfit i think this though most likely and then again with the leggings except i got some taco socks that i really think are cute and i actually didn't buy these somebody had gifted this to me at like a work event thingy so i just felt like these were real cute with this shirt and with the shoes i can probably wear my vans i can wear some boots i don't know it doesn't really matter but really the point of it is this shirt oh and then y'all so tell me why the freaking cow outfit had a little bow tie. And I'm about to show y'all to y'all. Even though I'm not going to redo the cow outfit. But I'm going to show y'all. I'm so mad I didn't see it in the bag. But one second. So anyways, back to what I was saying. So yeah. So it came with this too. Um, for the cow outfit. So if you are interested, it does come with a bow tie. I was wondering. Because I'm just like, it comes with a tail. It comes with the little band, you know, headband thing. And then nothing else. I'm like okay i honestly wanted something that can come with some little udders or something that would be even more funny but anyways um but yeah so this is the shirt the outfit really cute and i love orange on me and i just love that it says let me out so yeah um i think we got like i said like one or two more outfits left so all right i don't think y'all ready for this one ready can I get a jump rope? <laughs> Oink. Cute, huh? You can be a piggy for Halloween too. And look at my little tail. I think they should have had a curly tail, but this is the type of tail it comes with. Again, Amazon. <sighs> get into this pig, honey. Get into this pig, I mean. Just oinking it out around here. These are so cute. Kind of hard to breathe in. Maybe I'm just hype. I don't know, maybe not. But anyways, yeah, super cute. I decided to put it with this top I have, which is um, a maternity maternity shirt as well that I've been had in my closet. Cause I wasn't about to buy all this extra stuff. Like I bought this Amazon stuff like sometime in August to be honest. So, um, yeah, like I said, use your old stuff and just don't be spending all that money. Because my thing is, like, the more you spend, you're about to have a baby, y'all. So, you're not going to be able to wear this because you're going to slim down and you're going to be a whole nother size. So, yeah. But anyways, let me model for y'all. If I can get up. See, this is why I don't get down this low. <laughs> Woo. All right. And I have my little combat boots on with it. So, just want to get around. Super 
cute. Super, super, super cute. And I think this shirt, sorry, I had to iron it so it's kind of wet. But, um, or maybe that's milk. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, but this shirt was from, I think it was from Ross as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Ross, they don't have a maternity section really, but they have like a few. Like I, I've been to one. This thing going, <laughs> things is flying everywhere. So there was one Ross that I went to, they had a maternity section, like very, very small. I mean, probably like this big, literally like not much. And then they had another Ross I went to in a whole nother um, city. They didn't have maternity at all. So it just kind of just depends. You just want to look for stretchy stuff or, um, uh, or, you know, go up the size. Because the maternity clothes are actually really expensive to me personally. That's why I've stuck to Groupon and I will always stick to Groupon. I plan to keep all these clothes I got, <laughs> maternity clothes like that I do have. And like I told y'all, um, like maybe two videos ago that I am growing out of the maternity stuff. So it's really hard to shop and be pregnant at the same time. So that's why I like, there's some cute websites that my friend was telling me about, like boho or boohoo i don't know all these i mean the the outfits are freaking stylish let me tell you but my thing is like it's hard to tell what size because you don't know how big you're going to get how long that's going to last so i'm not about to be spending all this money yes it's cute but if i'm not really going nowhere i don't need to do that like if i was not pregnant during covid time i'd probably be a little bit more interested in it but since i wasn't um now, so maybe next pregnancy, I may <laughs> decide to go even more stylish, I guess, maternity-wise. But other than that, forget that, y'all. You gotta be cheap, honey. Cheap and cute. So, yeah. Anyways, I'm about to go to the next outfit because I'm tired of y'all staring at me and my nose. <laughs> Bye. All right, y'all. Last outfit of the day. Y'all really getting into this belly. Oh, I shake and I can feel him, like, juggling in there <laughs> creepy but uh yes so this is the last picket outfit is y'all ready is y'all ready is y'all ready is y'all ready boom honey boom 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 who said you cannot be I'm a pregnant lady. Look at that. Look at this. Like, ladies, do not allow your belly to stop you from being cute. So basically, with this outfit, this is an old crop top. Well, it's not really old. I probably bought it like last year. But obviously, it looks like it's a shirt that's too little, but it's not. It's actually a crop top. So it just makes it more funny because you got the belly out, and obviously. I was wearing this with my stomach flat. And then this skirt comes from, uh, what are those knees? Ooh. Okay, went away. Okay, so this skirt comes from actually Spencer's. I bought this skirt, y'all. <laughs> Ooh, let me think, let me think. Probably four years ago, to be honest. Was this 2020? Yeah, probably like four years ago. Yeah, I was like a freshman or sophomore in college. So I was like, hmm. And actually then it was actually really big on me. Like y'all don't understand how tiny I was. So now it fits, ooh, jiggling him again. That felt weird. Anyways, but now it's very um, uh, perfect for my waist because my hips have gotten bigger. So yeah, and then I matched it with those little, ooh, boy. You need to relax. <laughs> He's ready to eat. But yeah, I, have, I matched it with my little um, boy short leggings thing that I wore with my first outfit that I showed y'all. Just because, I mean, I'm not gonna show my butt. That's just, no. Um, and then I matched it with these socks and my combat boots again. You know, just to be really cute and sexy. Cause I mean, think about it y'all. We are literally about to be milk jugs. Like, <laughs> as soon as we have our, our cute little bundles of joy, we're about to be milk jugs, and we ain't gonna be looking as beautiful because we're gonna be, first of all, tired, um, 
And then we got poop everywhere, pee everywhere. I mean, just milk dripping everywhere. From what I hear, everything is gonna be flowing out like we're gonna be back on the period, everything. <laughs> like all the nasty TMI stuff. So therefore, you know, it's just the time. So before you have your bundle of joy, you know, have fun. Make sure you take pictures. Even if you don't take maternity pictures, just take pictures of this moment because it's gonna be gone once it's, once it's done. So, um, but yeah, so this is what I decided to get. My boyfriend really, really likes this outfit a lot. I mean, might as well have fun before, you know, he decides to come. So, but yeah, I think this is probably one of my favorite outfits, to be honest. Uh, if I lived in a much warmer state, I would wear this out, to be honest, and not care. But since I don't, the weather is kind of like bipolar, I, I wouldn't. And also, y'all, you don't have to wear like a crop top shirt. If you can find one of these skirts, um, you can just wear like a regular t-shirt and it'll cover your stomach. So, but um, this is what I had and I felt like it gave it a more like sexy look because because this is a crop top. So, um, but yeah, and then like I said, oh, these socks, I didn't tell you guys. I bought these socks from, I don't even know, but these socks, you can buy these anywhere. You can probably go to Walmart to be honest. And I've had these socks for a while too. Um, yes, but yeah, and then, oh, my little accessory. So as you see, I have, a clipboard, super old, that got paint on it, but y'all didn't know that. See, y'all didn't know that. So, because I, I had it this way. Got my little pen pretending to be, um, well, I didn't tell y'all what exactly I am. So, I would say maybe like a sexy pregnant nerd or sexy pregnant teacher, whatever you, however you want to put it. But the point is just to be sexy or just cute, however you want to be. But um, this is the, like I said, last outfit. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this, these little ideas of Halloween. Cause I told y'all this month was gonna be lit. I was gonna come with some bangers. So make sure you're subscribed if you are new, just now seeing me. Hey girl, hey, or hey boy, hey. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And turn your post notification bell on. And I'll see y'all next video.